Hello everyone. Um, today is Sunday. I'm spending the day with Spenny today. There he is. Um, we are currently just at like a wholesale place, I guess. And we're going to be looking for some workout equipment, but they literally have everything here. Like washer, dryers, flooring, decking, furniture, like everything under the sun. But we're looking for workout equipment. So we're going to go take a peek here today. Steven and I are going to spend the day together today because I've been gone. I'm going to update you guys that later today because I have to pack and stuff and leave again tonight. I sound really tired. Um, but yeah, we're just going to be spending some time together today because... We don't get to spend a lot of time together. That's what we're doing. I'm taking you guys along with me for the day. My mom is coming over later too because um, I have to give her her Mother's Day gift because I won't see her for Mother's Day. So yeah, anyways, we're gonna go inside now because there's so many people. So this is pretty much what we're looking for. A little elliptical or workout bike. We've had success. We found a workout bike. <laughs> Talking down a hundred bucks. Yeah, seriously. The bike retails for a thousand dollars and we got it for five fifty. So not bad. We just gotta go to the bank and uh get some cash. But seriously, if you guys have wholesale places like this around you, check them out because I think Steve and I are gonna come back when we're doing our backyard too, because they have like decking, outdoor furniture. They have literally so much stuff. All right, you guys, we're home. We did end up getting a bike, and I'll show you guys in a minute, but my mom is here because I have a gift for my mom. Um, hey, guys. <laughs> hey, guys. Oh, wait. Hey, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, my mom is here. I am gifting her her Mother's Day gift early because... <gasps> Be still my heart. <laughs> Anyways, I'm giving my mom her Mother's Day gift early because I am currently working out of town at the moment. I'm actually working on a film and um, I won't be home for Mother's Day, potentially. You so her. her gift came in early and I just decided I'm gonna give it to her today. We were hanging out today before I leave again this afternoon. So do you want your Mother's Day gift? I do. I'm trying to find my nail inspo picks first. Oh God, I might be the best child out of all three of us because I actually like got you a gift really early. <gasps> okay, here you go. <laughs> what did you get me, Cass? No, I'll explain. Okay, so I open it? Yeah. I didn't have time to wrap okay. it. <laughs> all right, let's see. You're always jealous of all the jewelry I wear. What did you get? What's it say? Mama. Oh my God. You don't have your glasses on? <laughs> <laughs> she, she couldn't read it because she didn't have her glasses on. <laughs> I love it, Cassie. That's so pretty. Actually, I really, really like this. I'm not sure if you were a gold fan, but... You can mix. Oh, <laughs> style tips. <laughs> you can blend. Oh, I like this. I almost got you this for your wedding. Did you really? Yeah, because it's a double infinity knot. It was you and me together. Oh. It's like you read my mind. Yeah. <laughs> you and me together for my wedding. Yeah. Mom, you got attachment issues there. <laughs> yeah. It's like I got you some pieces. I kind of got myself some too. <laughs> what? They're from the brand Ana Luisa that I get all my jewelry from. Oh, these are really pretty. Mm -hmm. Do you like them? I love them. Now, selfishly, when I was shopping for my mom, I did kind of pick up some stuff for myself. You guys know I'm a huge Ana Luisa fan. Like, literally, these two earrings that I wore, <clears throat> this pair I actually wore on my wedding day, and this one is from Ana Luisa. I also still have their necklace on. Like, I still am, like, a huge fan of them. I did pick up another pair of earrings from them that just oh, look I like, like this. Those. They're like a baguette style. You can't have them. They're can mine. I wear those? You can borrow them. But there's just like a baguette style earring. And then I think that's what you call it. I'm not sure. I got like a dainty style ring as well. Just something simple. So I thought that was cute. Their quality is so great that like I can use hand sanitizer, wash my hands a million times and like nothing turns weird or turns your fingers green or anything like that. Their jewelry literally lasts so long. I think I've literally kept these dangly ones in for months. 
haven't taken them out i shower in them i know you're not supposed to do that but i do and i do take these ones out at night <laughs> my mom's currently modeling her necklaces yeah so this one is the infinity style necklace it was supposed to symbolize me and you but you took it and <laughs> You and me forever. And then I got her the mama necklace that I just thought was so cute. I owe mama. I think it's fitting for Mother's Day too. And I do see that like these type of necklaces, like name necklaces are trending. So I thought it'd be cute to get her a mama one. Very trendy. I see them all the time. Thank you. I like. You did good. Number one child. For now. I'm gonna send that to Kenny and Cole. Since I potentially won't be home for Mother's Day, happy Mother's Day, mom. Aw, thank you, Gazzy. Ew, did you get lipstick yeah. on me? Ew. Ugh. All right, I'm putting in my new earrings. I took out these guys that I've showed you guys before in a previous video. I love these. Now I'm gonna put in these new hoops. There's the new hoops. Can I try them? Try them on me. No. Just try one. No, because then you're gonna steal them from I me. I just said one. <laughs> try one. Try one. Let's see. You like it? Oh yeah, they do look nice. I've just never really seen you with hoops on. Go look at them in the mirror. <laughs> You're so weird. Okay, give me my earring back. I want that. I kind of like it. All right, I'll get I'll get you a pair. Ew, no, don't do that. So I just came upstairs to our bedroom just so I could talk to you guys quietly. Um, Steve and my mom are currently downstairs chatting and stuff. So I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit more about the brand and the gifts that I gave her. So everything that you guys saw, I gave her some pieces from Ana Luisa Jewelry as well as, you know, getting stuff for myself because I'm a jewelry fanatic. You guys know this. I love, love, love getting new pieces and love getting jewelry. So I had to get some stuff for myself. But um, I want to tell you guys a little bit more about Ana Luisa and um, just why I chose them for my mom my mom is literally like my best friend so her and I share a very similar style we tend to share clothes we share jewelry even sometimes when it's special events we share a lot of things so a lot of times she's really just my best friend other than just being my mom and Ana Luisa was like the perfect idea for me to think of because I didn't a lot of times around holidays I really struggle with finding the things to get for my mom because whenever we see something we like we get it we're like literally the same person so I figured she would never be one to splurge on jewelry sometimes or get anything for herself like that. So I decided that would be the perfect option was to pick her up some new cute little dainty jewelry pieces and Ana Luisa was the first place I went to. And if you haven't watched any of my videos in the past or aren't familiar with Ana Luisa, they are literally the most incredible jewelry line out there. You guys know I wear them all the time. I wore them on my wedding day. I literally wear their pieces nonstop. Um, and I literally can tell you guys that nothing I own from them has tarnished. And I've washed my hands in them, worn sanitizer, showered even in them. Like their pieces are so, so good. And their price points are amazing. So honestly they have affordability for everybody their price points basically range from 39 dollars and up so there is something you could always find for yourself no matter your budget and if you guys don't know they are a sustainable company so they actually focus on being carbon neutral 100 percent of their carbon emissions of their products life cycle is actually offset so it's amazing so you guys know i love ana luisa i've talked about them a million times and i will continue to talk about them because i absolutely love them and i wanted to share with you guys that they actually have a discount code so if you guys want to pick up some new pieces either for yourself if you're a mama want to get some for your mama want to get some for a mama you know whoever or just get some for yourself if you're a puppy mama like me <laughs> um they are having a mother's day sale right now i will put the discount code right here and i'm also going to link everything down below in the description box for you guys they're having a 15% off all products sale so you definitely want to take advantage of this I think I'm actually gonna go back on and get my mom these earrings because she keeps talking about them now and now she's like mad I didn't give them to her so I think I'm gonna go ahead and get her some of the same earrings so we can be twins the sale is actually currently ongoing until Mother's Day and the last possible day I'll actually put it down below for, for you guys as well the last possible day to get pieces to you before Mother's Day for the US is May 5th and then international is May 3rd but I'll write that all down below for you guys but yeah just wanted to let you guys know that they are having a sale currently and you should definitely check it out so yeah, that's basically what I want to talk about real quick um, about Ana Luisa. And thank you to Ana Luisa for collabing with me on today's video. Sharing some amazing pieces with my mama that she literally is so obsessed with. 
you guys heard it. She called me the number one child. So Ana Luisa's leveling me up there. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to go back downstairs and then um, hang out with my mom for a little bit. And then I'm going to get back to packing. And I'll talk to you guys more about basically what I've been up to. All right. So this is the bike we got, you guys. Um, I don't know if you can see. Okay, there you go. So this was literally at the wholesale place. They had like Nordic tracks. They had like Echelon ones. They have all the brands basically. But this one seems like the best deal for us. It came with the weights on the back. You have the screen. Ignore my mess. This is literally how I'm living currently. Um, but it has the screen that you can like follow a trainer with and go like ride on trails and stuff. And yeah, it's pretty nice. We just kind of took it for a little test drive. So Maybe I'll work out before I leave today, but this was Liz, today's purchase. Okay, like I would, oh my God, I almost fell over. Um, like I was telling you guys, I'm in my closet right now. Literally an absolute mess. My house is a mess. Um, but like I was telling you earlier in this video, I have been out of town recently. I've actually been working out of town. I've been on film. And with that, um, this project is actually filming away from home so I've been actually living in a hotel Monday through Friday um, and then I come home on the weekends which is like fine but it's also like very very fast you know so every weekend I come home cycle out my suitcase and everything and then I go back again but um, that's why I said I was giving my mom her Mother's Day gift early because I really just wasn't sure if I was going to see her or not her schedule is so crazy and busy and so is mine so um, we were getting together today and her gift came in so I just kind of gave it to her early but today is Sunday which means the day I go back to my little cozy hotel in the middle of nowhere um, but yeah so I'm gonna start packing up my suitcase I just did all my laundry the of like the stuff from last week I pretty much just wash what I use and then repack everything I generally don't really pack new stuff um, occasionally I do like I'll check the weather and if it's gonna be a little bit different I'll change over my suitcase a little bit but it's still gonna be cold so I'm actually just looking for like more cold weather stuff but yeah so that's what I'm doing right now I'm just kind of getting all my stuff together in my suitcase and packing up everything I need for this week until I come back home. So it's always sad. I get like bummed out a little bit when I leave because it's like I just miss Svenny and the pup and stuff. And you, just, you know, just being at home is just more comforting sometimes. So I do get a little sad on Sunday. So if I get sad at the end of this video, just ignore me, but I'll be fine. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just getting everything together in my suitcase um, so I can get that packed up. Do you not want me to go? You want you want to come with me, Penny? Get in my suitcase. Get in my suitcase. I took a break from packing, and now I'm just doing my nails. I got this really okay. Some people might not like this color, but I think this color is great. It's this color from Essie. <laughs> Some of you are probably gonna be like, Cassie, are you really seriously putting this on your nails? I don't know why, but I love this color, and it's called Taxi Hopping. It's like a really pukey kind of color. <laughs> But I'm into it, so I am going to paint my nails and just take some time for myself before I have to leave. It's like 4 o'clock now. I'll probably leave here after dinner at like 6.30 maybe. <sighs> you know. But I pretty much have everything packed and tossed into the car. I was going to vlog myself packing, but like as I pack, I kind of get in the zone. So I just kind of threw everything in my car. And quite honestly... It's nothing that's like, I have no strategy when I'm packing. And since I'm driving there, I kind of overpack because I don't have to worry about an airplane telling me how much I can and cannot put on there. So yeah, there's no strategy. I just kind of threw a bunch of shit in my car and hope for the best. But I'm going to paint my nails because my nails are just so gross right now. I took my dip off and you can tell like my fingers they're so sensitive and like the nails are breaking so I have to keep my nails super short currently so I'm gonna put on a nail strengthener and then put this color on it so it just can look good presentably but kind of help you know strengthen my nails 
Also, when I get to my hotel, I'm gonna share with you guys um, some new tanning stuff I've been using that I actually seriously love. Um, and I think you guys will like it too. So I'll share with you once I get to my hotel. Um, Cause I'll, like, I have like a whole system when I unpack. I have like a system, you know? So <laughs> I'll share that with you guys later. I'm gonna probably scrub my body tonight and like do a new one because this is like an old tan. So it looks kind of gross right now, but I might do a new one later. All right, you guys. Sorry, the sun is shining behind me, but it actually looks kind of pretty. Um, I'm off now. I just left home about 20 minutes ago, collected my thoughts. I get very emotional when I leave home. I am an extreme homebody to a T, and I hate being out, and I hate being without my husband sometimes and my dog, so bear with me. <laughs> but, um, I'm off now. I am on my way to the hotel. So yeah, I basically live at a hotel on Monday through Friday. Well, technically Sunday through Friday, and then um, I come home Friday nights, stay till Sunday, and go back. This hotel is also like in the middle of nowhere. Um, I kid you not, literally in the middle of nowhere. I lose service a lot. Um, so yeah, it's fun, fun and exciting. Okay, guys, just got to my hotel. I'm gonna be quiet because. I talk louder you definitely can hear in this hotel but i'll give you guys a little hotel room tour it's not the cutest place i will say um it's it's something you know but i'll give you guys a little hotel tour i'm a move into my hotel room kind of person so i put all of my shoes and coats hanging Especially since I'm pretty much living in this place for like six weeks. It just helps, you know, to see what I have and have everything out in front of me and feel kind of homey. You know what I mean? And then here's the bathroom area. So like I said, I literally move in. All my skincare, toothbrush, makeup, all of that. What's up? We have the bathroom. You know? nothing cute but like i said it's old it just you know needs a little update but it does the trick for now okay and then we move into the main area which is the bedroom i move in to this space so i have all of my stuff over here when i get ready um we did end up getting a fridge and microwave later on in our stay i think like by week two we ended up getting these so thank god because um i like to have water in any food that I bring in and then I also have started to make my own coffee here it sounds crazy but it's necessary the hotel coffee here has been awful and I'm not trying to be like rude bratty picky but it's like when you just want the comforts of your own home sometimes stuff like this helps and since I'm living here for a long time it's kind of I don't see the reason like I don't see a problem in bringing it. However, if I was only here for like a week, I think a lot of this stuff would not be here. But since I'm like here back and forth, back and forth for like six weeks, I don't see the issue. So then this is the bed I sleep in. I always bring an essential oil diffuser with me when I travel, it just helps me sleep at night. And I'm a baby, but I need a nightlight. So if you're like me, <laughs> sorry. I'll admit it, I need a nightlight, so yeah. I usually bring my own pillow from home if I'm driving, just because it's more comfortable. And then on the other bed, if I'm not using it, I actually lay out my suitcase. So I don't even bother with those like suitcase racks that you can get in your hotel rooms. Like this one has one, but I don't bother with those. I literally just lay my whole suitcase out on the bed and then I can see everything. I'll usually even sometimes what I do is I all of like some similar stuff out so like my jeans and stuff so that way I can see it a lot easier and then I can move around in my suitcase a little bit better but yeah so yeah have all that stuff so I'll say I might be like a hypochondriac or whatever but I just with COVID and stuff and now staying in hotel rooms it still kind of grosses me out a little bit so I just don't I don't bother with that and speaking of COVID I literally bring with me Tide antibacterial fabric spray so I can sanitize the bed sheets and everything. And I always bring Clorox wipes so I can wipe down everything before I touch anything. Sounds dramatic, like I said, but whatever, it eases my mind. 
And then over here, I just have like my coffee, wine, thank you, some food in there, and just like, you know, a drop off area. This is where I've been, you guys. It's been fun. I love doing films and stuff, so it's nice to get back into the film life. The last film I did was back in last March, like literally two weeks before the shutdown of COVID was the last time I did a film. So being back into doing film, it's, it's been fun. I really like it. And all the people that are on set are just amazing. And a lot of the girls I love, um, a lot of the people that I work with, I do know, and they are like the most amazing and talented people ever. So it's actually been a really good positive experience too. So yeah, anyways, I'm at my hotel. I'm probably just gonna chill. I'm gonna take off my makeup and stuff. I wanted to share this with you guys though. Sorry, the lighting in here is gross, but tonight I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to shower and then I'm actually going to put on a new tan and the tan I've been using is this one from Lux Unfiltered. It is so, so, so good. I put this all over my body. It doesn't really smell that much. If it does, it just smells a little bit like roses um, and there's no transfer onto your sheets so you can sleep in white sheets. I literally did a test for you guys. I slept in white sheets nothing transferred not even to my clothing and um it just feels like lotion on your body it's so nice it comes on clear so it's actually really easy to blend and i didn't really have any streaks or any like marks or anything like that it was pretty seamless so i love this i also got just like the regular lotion in the scent santal which smells so good but it's just the right hint of scent where it like doesn't bother you so really really like this I also got the bronzing face drops that I literally just mix this into my daily moisturizer and put it on all over my face and it literally just like you wake up with like this sun-kissed skin it's amazing I actually don't even wear foundation when I use this so I'm gonna put some of this into my moisturizer tonight but I want to share that with you guys because it's been so nice you probably can tell I have some concealer on but my mask kind of wiped off the rest of the makeup, but anyways, <laughs> that's what I'm doing tonight. Okay, I fixed the lighting a little bit, but I'm going to get ready for bed and wash my face. I'm going to take off my jewelry, so that's going to be including my little Ana Luisa pieces I just got. I actually have my necklaces on, and when I travel, whatever jewelry I want to bring with me, I like put on. So I just took off some other jewelry that I just like threw on, but um, yeah, I'm going to take my jewelry off. So I can wash my face. Usually what I do is I just put my stuff in like a cup in my hotel room. Okay, and take off. I'm literally obsessed with these earrings, you guys. They're so, so, so pretty. And they're super lightweight too, so like you I honestly forgot that they were on my ears, so I'm pretty happy with those. Anyways. Okay, I came over here because I feel like people in the hall can hear me. That's why I'm talking so low. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I, Like I said, I'm just going to get ready for bed and call it a night. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And like I said, if you guys want to check out Ana Luisa and their Mother's Day sale, if you still need to buy anything for your mama or someone you know, feel free to check out the link in my description box. I'll put it all down there for you. Again, it's 15% off everything on their site and if you want to order in time to get everything before mother's day order by may 5th in the u.s and may 3rd international it should get to you in time so anyways thank you guys so much for watching i love you all so much thank you ana luisa for collabing with me again in this video and i will see you guys in my next video bye